Kyrian Yaga governor and Uyghur who says she has received offers to be presidential running mate from two parties ahead of the 2022 polls. The first time governor says she is considering the offers and will make an announcement at an appropriate time. I have at least two offers for the deputy president position, but it is not the right time to name the parties," she said in an exclusive interview with the news. Ms. Wigaru said she believes the Jubilee party will still form the next government and sees herself a playing a critical role in the populous Mount Kenya region to make this happen. Deputy President William Ruto is currently seen as the front-runner in Jubilee and the likely candidate for the party. There is also another splinter group that wants to stop the deputy president and is likely to either team up with the opposition party or form a third alliance to wrestle Mr. Uto out of the presidency. Ms. Wigaru, the Council of Governors vice chairperson, said the Mount Kenya region will have to ensure that it gets its rightful share of development in the next government, and that is what her role will be when President Uhuru Kenyatta's succession race starts in earnest. I see my role as making sure the 10 counties that make up the Mount Kenya region get their rightful place in the next government. We do not want a boardroom appointee to lead the region, but rather a person who is the choice of the people," she said. She distanced herself from a group that says the region is not getting its share of development projects, saying those are views of a few people. She said that in as much as there are policy issues that need to be dealt with to make sure the region is not disenfranchised, it is getting significant investments relative to constraints.